Welcome inside the Mountain West Network Studio. I'm Jesse Kurtz here with your first look at the 2023 Mountain West Indoor Track and Field Student Athletes of the Year as voted on by the league's coaches. We have co-female athletes of the year, starting with Amelia Shostrand from San Jose State, who set the school record and finished the indoor season ranked seventh in the nation in the women's triple jump at the NCAA Indoor Track and Field Championship. She also placed 11th in the long jump at the national championship. Shostrand was named the Mountain West Women's Performer of the Meet at the conference championship after winning gold in the long jump and triple jump. So both coach TJ Harris and coach Ryan, uh, they've helped me a lot and just made sure that I had all the tools kind of to, to make this work and just everyone on my team and my friends and my family, everyone has been very supportive in helping me achieve this. It's been quite a long journey to get to where I am now, so it's very amazing to be able to do it with everyone. UNLV's Rosa Santana is the other co-female athlete of the year in indoor track and field after placing third in the nation in the shot put with a Mountain West record mark of 18.43 meters, earning first team All-America honors for the first time in her career. Santana won the event at the Mountain West Championship with a record mark of 17.91 meters. The moment I heard, I couldn't believe it because it's my first year. I believed in myself, of course, but I didn't know I'd be able to go so far as to set a new record in the conference and at UNLV. I feel good. This truly feels great. At the same time, I'm happy for my team that has supported me so much since the start. The male indoor track and field athlete of the year is Sam Gilman from Air Force. The senior finished the indoor season with an 11th place finish in the 3,000 meter run at the NCAA championship, picking up the fourth All-America award of his career. At the Mountain West Championship, Gilman anchored the distance medley relay, leading a Falcon victory. He also clocked the fastest mile time in qualifying the very next day before closing out the meet by posting the fourth fastest time in Mountain West Championship history, successfully defending his conference title in the mile. In doing so, he becomes the third runner in league history to ever win back-to-back -back championships in that event. It's not an award you take for granted when, when the guys you, who com you compete against and who coach against you um, recognize you. Um, so it, it's definitely an honor, it's very special. And it's, it's great to, to win it for uh, not only represent the Air Force Academy at the highest level, but also the Mountain West at the highest level like I did at the NCAA Championships indoors. So it's a great honor and it's, it's very exciting. Gilman claims the conference's top honor for a second consecutive year. It also marks the third time in the last four occasions it's gone to an Air Force Falcon. Congratulations to this year's winners. From the Mountain West Network Studio, I'm Jesse Kurtz.